Welcome back, everybody. I'm Pixel Dragon, and you're watching an, uh, a Let's Play of Elden Ring. In the last episode, we wrapped up exploring Stormville Castle after taking down Godric the Grafted, and now we are on our way to uh, what is it? Uh, like Lyernia of the Lakes, I think. Uh, From the, starting off that lakeside cliff. All right, these churches have historically been pretty awesome. Church of Erith. Oh, not Merica. Okay. There's a dude. Got myself a sacred tear. Okay. You're tarnished, aren't you? Then. Perhaps you could spare some runes. Believe it or not, I studied glintstone sorceries at the Academy of Rhea Lucaria. For a small donation, I'd be happy to share my knowledge. Well, bless you, bless you. Yeah, give him ten runes, why not? Saint. My name is Topes. Presuming you're interested, I can teach you sorceries, as promised. Only, none of them are particularly great. Well, you could have told me that beforehand, man. Apologies, friend. I'm afraid my meager sorceries are no match for your generosity. All oh, right, I can tell you what I know about this place. That should help a bit. You've seen that structure to the north, towering over the water. That's the Academy of Rhea Lucaria, where we study glintstone sorceries. Only its doors have been closed for quite some time now. After they declared they wouldn't interfere with the shattering, the Academy cast repelling seals on the East Gate leading to the capital, and the South Gate leading here. As you might have guessed, the seals are still active, making entry to the Academy impossible without a glintstone key. And so I'm stuck here. A fledgling sorcerer with little chance of acquiring a key. When they cast the seals, I'd just popped out. And now I'm uprooted from my place of learning. Huh. Why not find yourself a glintstone key? Without one, you can't pass through the academy. And you'll never reach the Erdtree capital. And if you find an extra glintstone key, perhaps, once you've tied up all your loose ends, and I can be very patient, would you consider donating it to me? I know it. I'm a bluntstone. Nary a hint of talent for sorcery. But still, my place is at the academy. Okay. You've taken an apprenticeship with Selen. Well, that is something. Selen was well known. The most promising sorceress in the history of the academy. I followed her at school. But there may as well have been an ocean between us. But Selen was expelled from the academy. Accused of unthinkable treatment of certain sorcerers under the name of the Graven Witch. I still don't believe the accusations. The illustrious Selen would never do such things. I wonder who the Graven Witch is. I wonder if I can ask Selen. Uh, so this guy can teach me Glintstone Pebble. Um, requires 10 intelligence, which I do have. Uh, it costs 7 FP to cast, so that's a little under 10%. Um, man, I don't, I don't know. You know what? It's a thousand. Why not? Uh, you know, that, that way I have it. So. Um, okay, so. I need to find a glintstone key to get into the academy. So the academy is probably going to be one of the main areas in in Lyernia. Okay. Forest and cemetery. Let's do cemetery, then forest. Yeah, I figured this, this dude's be popping out of the ground. Oh, there's one. Ow. 
There we go. Academy scroll. Okay, so I'd probably take that to sell in. The Royal House scroll is something I took to sell in before, and it expanded her uh, set of things that she could teach. I can't really... I, I mean, I'm not a... I'm not that kind of character, so I can't learn them, but, you know, it's always nice to have those things there. Okay. Let's see here. Anything else this cemetery wants me to, uh, wants me to have? Doesn't look like it. Bunch of birds up here. Uh, uh, I don't see anything. Okay. Then let's get torrent. Here we go. Oh, there's an up path too. Let's let's check that out. Some people are dying up here. Let's see why. I'm seeing all these blood pools on the ground. Um. Oh, okay, there we go. Hey, look, I joined, I, I joined everybody who just died. Um, now I, now I know why everybody died here. Wow, that was, uh, rather immediate. Alright, well, uh, let's go avenge ourselves and, uh, kick the shit out of that guy. I am not overly fond of being one-shot, so, uh... I will do my best to kick the crap out of him. There we go. Got these back. Is there anything over here? I thought I saw something shining. Oh, it's just a mushroom. Alright. I think he popped out over here. Good lord. Oh, back up. Wow, that is a lot of angry skulls. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, okay. So really all I want um, is the item that's over there. It's not really worth it to, to fight all of them and make sure that they're all dead. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to run in, grab my runes, grab the item, bail. I was thinking that maybe killing the, uh, the tougher dude with the, with the cleaver. Um, or whatever that giant axe was. Um, I thought killing him would get me something, but since it didn't, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna take my stuff and leave. Come on, get my more runes. There we go. A warming stone. Wow, he is fast. Well... You want to do this all one-on-one -on -one style sure okay that was a bad plan damn it oh my god I do not like you there we go Ugh. I don't like either of you. 
But you guys I can handle. I can run past you and be fine. Is there anything else up here? I didn't want to like miss an item like hiding behind this. Uh, no, I don't see anything. What about over here? No? Alright, cool. Alright. In that case, we are going to go into that forest. Actually, what's over here? A big old cliff. Into the ocean. Okay. All right. Let's do this. Okay. Going to take it a little bit slow going through here. I don't know what is waiting around the corner for me. Picking up some row of fruit. Get some beast bones. Behold tranquility, all the more behold hope. Yeah, I don't believe, uh, I don't believe that there's going to be any tranquility over here. Call me crazy, but I don't, uh, I don't trust it when things are all quiet and calm. Alright, let's get these guys out. Evidently, when they die, they all, um, they start, like, popping glint stones. Okay. Alright, kill the group. That was not too bad. Cuckoo glint stone, short sword... Glintstone Craftsman Cookbook. Pretty neat. Oh. Alright. Lots of stuff to break. Not doing this because, uh... Yeah, that's why I'm doing it, because I want to find something. Smoldering Butterfly? Okay. I, I, man, I, I haven't even done item crafting a single time, I don't think. Oh, you know what? I can. I have these two guys. Uh, so, fire pot or holy water pot. Uh, roped fire pot. Throw behind. Um, I'll do this. Right, two fire pots. And I'll put them in my inventory. In my equipment. There we go. And here we go. Oh, side of grace. Oh, and a merchant. Hey, look at that. Can I not touch the grace? There we go. Let's go talk to this dude. You're new around here. Surprised you found me in my little nook. No matter, no matter. Your money's as good as anyone else's. Why don't you take a look at my wares? Oh, but don't ask me how I got my hands on them, eh? What is up with the giant back scratcher he's holding? That's weird. 
And what is that other thing? It's like a... I have no idea what that is. A stick with a bunch of rocks nailed to it? Uh, already got a lantern. Uh, nomadic warrior's cookbook. Astrologer hood. Astrolo um, astrologer staff. Uh, Estoc, a thrusting sword. If we can get some smithing stones, that'd be nice. Um, I am going to get the cookbook. I do want those. Smithing stone two. I'll buy two of those. Because I need six of them in order to... Um, in order to upgrade my my falchion. My blood falchion. All right. Um, I need to find a map for this place. Uh, so you'll notice on the map, it's all very, very dark. Uh, it will remain that way until I find an actual map. Oh, let's see what the uh, Nomadic Warriors cookbook got me. Uh, I don't know how to look up uh, how I how I got certain recipes, so I don't know. Uh, probably, probably these arrows. That's, that's my guess. All right, so we're gonna wander around, see if we can find ourselves a map. Hey, a choir? What am I choir? A glintstone firefly? Okay. I, I honestly have no idea where I'm going. Well, that looks friendly. Um, I'm going to stay away from it, actually. Just until I can find a... Oh, oh my god. Stay away and stop being creepy. A grave violet? Hey, look at this. I found a map. Woo! A new map has been found. Oddly, it doesn't show me the part of the map I'm in, which is the lake. It shows me some land. Okay. Well, that is actually very helpful. So let's go. I'm going to take that as a sign that I'm supposed to... Um, Come on. There we go. Uh, that I'm supposed to explore the land area first. Alright, so we need to go... How do I go that direction? Is this the way? No, it wants me to go this way. Yeah. Maybe the uh, map for the water area will be this direction. Okay. Hmm. All right. Um, what I have found to be an effective strategy with those guys is just, like, um, because they hover just out of range of your sword, um, pop. Just, just, just jump and swing, and, uh, and you'll, you'll hit most of the time. I don't know why you chose to crawl. That was 
Not the greatest plan. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Alright, so I'm like on this like little lower area. Um Oh, okay, but it does it does go up to that land. Okay. Alright, in that case, let's just get on torrent. Let's not uh Let's not drag it out. That's why we got a horse. Alright. Oh, and I can jump up there, so that's one option, but I don't want to miss stuff. So... If I keep going... Um, I, I'm thinking that if I if I do jump up, then I'm gonna miss um, like items and stuff going to uh, because it'd be like, oh, here, take this shortcut, and, and it's like, yeah, but you miss, you miss the items that you get along the way, even though they're usually smaller things. Okay. All right, so we got some baddies up there. I got a puppers here. Some place called the Purified Ruins. Go, got a smithing stone out of that guy. Here, dog. Oh my god. Okay. Cuckoo glint stone. Oh shit. Oh. Oh, there's a dude over here. Oh, and another dude. All right. Man, this this is a turned out to be a lucrative little spot for me. I'll go down those stairs in just a moment. I wanna I wanna search around and um top side and see if I can find uh, more items and stuff. Hey, like this guy here. I think you really missed the mark on your job. Like, if you're gonna blow the horn to alert everybody, you should try to do it when they're alive. I'm not trying to tell you how to do your job, but just a suggestion. All right, let's see what's behind or under this temple. A Shabriri grape. Hey, nice. Two fingers heirloom. Looks like a key item. Is it not? Oh, what was a warming stone? I picked that up earlier. Use this FP to continually heal nearby allies. Oh, that's pretty awesome. Uh... Two fingers... Um... Item... Where... What was that? Uh, two fingers heirloom, I think it was called. Oh, it raises faith. Oh, okay. It's a it's a talisman. Be uh, be good if you were doing a faith build. Faith build. Okay. What else we got up here? Is 
that's uh that's not the direction I'm gonna be facing. I wanna be facing this way. Yeah. Oh no, not you guys. Look. You guys suck. I hate you. You like you about murdered me in that swampy area. Why did the music get all gloomy? Super fast. Cuckoo glint so I keep picking that up. Let's let's see what that does. Uh uses FP to produce magic bolt. Alright. I mean uh kinda I, I like using my FP for my blood slash and summoning my wolves, so. Um situation might arise where I'll, where I will use it though. That is entirely possible. Oh, hey, side of grace, nice. There's some dudes up there. What is that? That honestly looks like a bomb. It looks like something that's gonna, like, explode on me. Okay, um... Golden Room 6? Oh, nice! I really thought that was gonna be like um, something that falls down and just has a big flame explosion or something, but I I had to find out. I could not leave it be. I am definitely the cat that Curiosity killed. Okay, so there's a little bit extra beyond here. Oh, what the hell is that? You guys see that? It's like a big old like flesh golem or something. Hey, ya boys. Again, they're so bad at their only job. Okay. Oh, oh, it's one of those giants. That's what it is. Okay. Oh, but he's untethered. Like, this guy can... This guy can do some work. Um, I'll be honest, I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can actually take this guy.
Man, this this dude. Oh, 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 oh. oh man, that special attack, that thing, uh, that thing just annihilates these dudes. All right. Uh, so, oh, look at that. All these dead bodies, he was like super pissed. Um, because they had him enslaved. So, they're like, all right, well. I'm going to untether myself and smash y'all. Let's see what goodie we get as a reward. A tree spear. Uh, let's see. The tree spear is a great spear. Uh, it's Pierce Sacred Order is the name of its special attack. Uh, it is strength, dex, and faith all evenly split. All D. Uh, strength 15, dex 22, faith 18. Okay. I've been finding a few faith weapons lately. What is that? Silver Firefly? Pretty neat. Is there something down here? Okay, well, um, that's an obvious death spot. Okay, pretty neat. And so that's this little area here. We've got the purified ruins, okay. Okay, so that is a great spot to wrap up this episode. Uh, so we're gonna end here, and in, in the next episode, we're gonna continue uh, on this path uh, going north, and we're gonna see if we can find another map to uh, show us the second half of, I think it's Lyurnia. Uh, yeah, so I will see you all in the next episode.